Hey, and I'm back like I never left, man. Welcome to another Amp Up Crew vlog, man. I told you I was gonna keep this shit coming consistently. Hey, the car came in for a little, little light cover. Shit, so I'm gonna pick that up from the mailbox and uh, show y'all what that looks like. And then I might put it on this weekend. I don't know if I'm gonna do it today. I don't feel like fucking with this shit today. Cause I'm on my way to the gym to get some shots up and train. So, yeah, I'll see y'all when we get to the mailbox. We at the mailbox. This is my first time ever coming to this mailbox. I ain't even gonna hold y'all. And it better be it. And it is in here. I got the package. I'm struggling. I'm struggling. Don't say shit. Yeah, I got the package. Simple. Simple. I got it. But, uh, yeah. Like I said, stay tuned for this. Might put it on this weekend. I might. I don't know. Like I said, I don't feel like dealing with it today, but I might. So, got the package for this shit. And this is what I'm going to be replacing. Getting this ugly ass shit off of here. This shit is going to be gone. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned for that. And we got more shit that I'm going to order. It's going to be coming in here pretty soon. So, stay tuned for that. But until then, we out. Until I turn this shit back on. Stay tuned. Tell them. Stay tuned. Tell them what? Stay tuned? Stay tuned. Yeah. They know, all right, so. But it probably is. All right, so I'm about to open this thing. Like I said, y'all already know what it looked like. I showed y'all in the last video. Hopefully this shit fit. Hi. So, I'm going to fuck around Hi. and probably try to put this shit on this Hi. Weekend, should go out there and do it right now, but I don't feel like doing that shit right now. But uh, this is supposed to be the piece. Hopefully, this is the right piece this time. Oh shit, air pop fell out. Hopefully, it is this right one this time. Got the screws and shit. Like I said, I still might paint them. So stay tuned for this shit. Hopefully, it's the right shit. If not, I'm gonna be mad. All right, we yeah. um, tell them what you gotta say. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Tell them. Say say subscribe. That's the card. Tell them to say subscribe. Yeah, say we out of here. I don't even know where to start, man. We got some bad news. The charger is down again. No! I'm guessing. I'm guessing. I'm guessing. The radio is fucking blue. Driving it, heard a loud noise. Popped. Pulled over, stopped. Fucking radiator flew up. Just flooding from the bottom. So I don't know where it's coming from. It's definitely not coming from the hose that I changed for sure. Uh, from any of the the, uh, the points that I put them on there, so I'm guessing it's the radiator because it was hissing as well from it hitting the hot car and it being the radiator being hot itself. So I'm out here making cutouts to get to the fucking radiator because of this shit. This thing is hard to get out. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I tried, didn't have time to fucking try to do it. So I'm cutting out points to where the radiator mounts are right here. There's another one right here. I'm already working on cutting out and. Uh, of course, I'm going to have to take the bottom shit out. The skip plate, like, from the last time I did, that's going to take a while because there's so many fucking clamps and fucking whatever the fuck you want to call these fucking little things to take out. And then I got to do it from the wheel well as, uh, as well from the inside of here. If, hold on, I'm showing it. The inside of here to get these shits out. So, yeah, it down again. It shot out a lot. The tank dropped uh, quite a bit. From out of, of course, from it leaking. But it leaked from the side over here, which this is from rain. This is not from the radiator. Of course, that'd be some crazy shit. But, yeah, so it just starts spewing everywhere again, all in down there. Up here at the top of the shit, had it shit leaking every fucking where, spraying everywhere. So, what I'm going to do is fucking, like I said, cut the, finish cutting this out, undo the mounts, take that bottom, the bottom skip plate off. There's two more bolts down there. I watched this video from this guy. I'm definitely going to tag him and put him in my description in case anybody else having a problem with a 2015 or newer charger taking the radiator and changing it. But, of course, we got to remove the fans, which he said in the video, that's the hardest fucking part. So, once I get that shit off and get these certain hose clamps off of this shit to take it off. And some the one that is down there, the one I replaced, I don't know if y'all be able to see it, but there's one down there that I replaced that that shit was hard to get to. So... Yeah, and then unplug the fans, of course, and shit like that. And then I might have to take my coat air and take off. Not for sure. He did, he did take the the air duct off, but I'm going to try to finesse it and try to get it around it. So, yeah, stay tuned for this shit. This shit is fucking wild. Like, it's always something. Some new every day. But we're going to get the shit done. It is what it is, shit. It's a part of car life, shit. So, stay tuned for that, and I'll turn this shit back on once I get done cutting this shit out and get this motherfucker out and i would record it but as y'all can tell it's definitely been raining on and off so i can't have my camera here set up and shit like that so i wish i could get y'all the footage of me taking it in and out but shit i ain't risking it for my camera to be 
messed up. So stay tuned for that shit, and I'll let y'all know how it goes and see what I find. So after, after being out here for a while, Big Warren stopped through, helped me with the jack, bought me the jack. We found out what the problem is. They said, the dude in the video did say that these chargers are known for the right passenger lower fan to fuck up and break off and shoot into the radio. So, that's exactly what the fuck happened. I don't know if y'all gonna be able to see it, but I'm about to try to show y'all. See that big ass chunk right there into the radiator? Yeah, that's a part of my fan, I'm guessing. And it's jammed out of in there. I think that's what caused it, I believe. Unless it's something else at the very bottom of it, but we ain't got that far yet, but yeah. So I'm about to try to lift and get this shit out of here. What happened? We we moved it a little bit more. We can see down. Jeremy knocked the piece down. What what was it? What the fuck happened? Sibling. Two of them, right? Yeah. I would be able to. I wish I could show y'all, man. It's too. It. Yeah, I can't. I, this shit is just too far. It's too crammed in here. But I'm about to try to wiggle this shit out. Try to figure it, see if it hit the bottom. But yeah, two blades. But yeah, stay tuned for this shit. As Jeremy is shaking this shit, there go two of the blades. Look at this shit. The rest of it is coming out. This is a whole fucking fan blade. This shit. This shit. This shit. And this shit. This, this is fucking crazy. Wow. I will Fuck, man. Stay tuned. So this is the passenger lower fan as y'all can tell definitely missing fucking teeth they said in the video i watched they known for these lower ones to fail so i'm about to order that and a new fucking radiator now so yeah that's fucking great but yeah jeremy pushed it through the bottom made me drag it out so it made it look a little bit worse than what it is now nah, i'm just playing it look like this before we push this bitch out but yeah so yeah stay tuned for putting this getting this shit ordered and putting this shit in here and i'm gonna make jeremy do most of the work so I went ahead and ordered the new radiator and I'm gonna go the cheap route and this fan right here I think the one is replaceable that I got which I looked at it and everything looks perfectly fine on it So I just bought this like the fan itself and I'm gonna just easily unbolt to take the old one out Replace it with that one and I got the radiator coming in as well So they saying well this one's supposed to be here Monday and this one's supposed to be here Tuesday So now I gotta wait still down a car, but shit it ain't too far from now It's Saturday so shit it just sucks not having my car running but it is what it yeah. is, part of having a car, so shit. Stay tuned for that when we get this shit in. Then we're going to take the radio out to maybe today. If not today, maybe Monday. That way we can have it prepped for Tuesday. So stay tuned for that. Tell them. Tattoo. Yeah. All right, this is day two. We got the radiator out. Well, I wouldn't even say two days because it didn't take us that damn long. Jeremy Blackass is back again, you know, helping. He doing what he doing. But, uh, yeah, this is what it looked like. Jeremy trying to figure out how the shit started leaking, but I don't know. Shit, some fucking magical way. This is how the fucking fan tore it up. So, yeah. Definitely need a new radiator because it got a hole right in here. And fucking whatever it did there. And then down here as well, too. So, yeah. So, we got it out. Uh, the next step is waiting for the parts to come in. Got the coat air and take off. All that shit. There you go, the condenser right there. Shit, got all that shit loose. And uh, hoses and fucking clamps and shit. I'm gonna fix the hose in a minute. Here go one of the new hoses I had put on when I replaced that bottom hose all the way up until in there. But yeah, so yeah, so stay tuned for this. This shit has been fun, not really, but uh, yeah, we getting this shit done though. It sucks, but it gotta be done. I'd rather do this shit this way than fucking pay arm and leg for a dealership to do it. So. Yeah, when all that shit come in, we have record putting that shit in. Shout out to my boy Worm. He coming over here and helping me and shit. Big ass help. I'm talking about a big ass help. If you know what I mean. But, yeah. We'll be back. So, I got the radiator in. Both parts came in. Even though they didn't update their shipping. They should have. But both of the parts came in. This is the fan itself. I'm about to unbox these shit. So, give me a second. I would set my tripod up, but I don't feel like doing it. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. It's going to take something. But, I'm about to unbox this shit. I'm not even gonna lie to you, I almost had a heart attack. I thought this shit was too big, bro. I had to go down and check. I was about to be fucking livid. But this is the new fan. This is the shit. Look how many TV. We're like, so, how many TVs on here? That's three at the top. Whatever. It only had two left out of all these shit. I don't, you know, mine ain't quick with math or numbers, so don't disregard. But yeah, that's the fan. And then it came with a new boat as well. So, I'm about to go downstairs and bolt this shit on quick and easy. And the radio is getting open as we speak. And this is the new radiator right here. 
Of course, y'all know what a radiator look like. Uh, the box came fucked up like this, so I was hoping it had no damage. Look, who delivered the box like this? Thanks, UPS. This came UPS, right? Yeah. Yeah, well, look but at this shit. Maybe, maybe it like but, it UPS. It could have been somebody else that did But yeah, so, yeah. That's how it looks. Back over, about to get the rest of it out, and then I'm about to try to drop this shit in here, get this shit done, and over with quick. So stay tuned for that, too. So this is the fan I gotta take off. As y'all can see, all the teeth is missing. Take this boat off, old boat, and use a new one. So I'm about to yank this off real quick and get this shit going. New wheel on. Easy. Like I said, it wasn't hard at all. This is what the old one looked like. It's definitely not supposed to look like that, for sure. But yeah, so off with that goes in there. But new wheel on. Spin it perfectly fine. Now on to mess with the radio. And guess who showed up again? Boy, I'm attack his Instagram on here so y'all can blow up his DMs. His nickname Jay Poopy Truck. He like when you call him that. <laughs> Alright, here got a new radiator. We just checked it and went over it. Looked perfectly fine, even though the box came fucked up. Nothing don't look <clears throat> broke or punch. Oh shit! So yeah, we about to try to drop this motherfucker right back in here. And yes, don't crucify me. This shit is dusty. He about to clean it though. We'll drop that bitch right back in here where it goes. And make sure it was well, it's gonna fit, I know it is. But move okay, all these holes connected, but yeah. Stay tuned, dusty ass engine. All right, we got the new radiator in there. Told y'all I was going to walk like this. Gay ass. Uh, my bad. I gotta bleep that out. Uh, I gotta connect. <laughs> I gotta connect that hose down there. And then, of course, this one's up top. That's gonna be easy. So I gotta get back under there. But we got the new radiator in. Line up, lined up and everything. Stop. Anyway. But yeah, I got it. we got it in there fit, but we still got to do the fans. I ain't no. Oh wow! So putting the fan back in, we had to remove this Don't shit. Touch it. I ain't gonna touch it. Why? I ain't gonna touch it. What's gonna do to me? But uh, yeah. So we had to remove that hose, which is this right here. It's two easy bolts, and we're gonna try to slide this fan back in here because everything's bolted in, secure, and yeah, we're gonna see. Yeah, fuck the radiator. Yeah, oh god, we didn't. Got the fan in from the top. It was kind of a struggle getting it around this pulley, this pulley. And we just wed found a way to wiggle that wedge that bitch in, but yeah, I got better ones after a while, but it's cool. We did have to take this shit off where the thermostat thing is, but shit. We about to bolt this in, get this shit right, and then start buttoning this shit back up, and run some more radiator fluid in that bitch, and go from there. No leaks. I don't know if y'all can hear me, but I'm going to talk loud. We ain't got no leaks on either side, or from the radiator, nothing. We're running the cooling through it right now. Got everything hooked up, car is on. Sound good. See what it's going. Still till it start sucking through the radiator and shit. But next step, we got everything in there, fans, everything, all that shit on. Next up, let's put the skip plate back under there. I'm about to jack the car back up after I get done doing this shit. And then we'll be done. So yeah, got everything in there. Shit, we about to see. Well the fans working perfectly fine, the new fan on there, they kicked on after it's sitting. I hope y'all can hear me, hope it ain't too loud, but yeah, the fans kicked on, they running fine, looking good. So everything is running right, temperature right, you zoom in on that mud, a little dusty hand drove in a while, but yeah, everything fine. Shit, me and, me, me, me and my nigga Jerm did that shit, I'm dirty as shit though, I'm a mechanic every now and then. That's besides the point. But, uh, yeah, I gotta button this shit up and stay tuned. It might be more to this vlog. It might not. I don't know. This might be the end. The next big project is getting this back, getting this to a floor shifter. So stay tuned for that shit. That's gonna be lovely. All right, I'm dirty. I got everything buttoned up. I got the skip plate under there. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's back under there. But I got another problem. Yeah, I gotta get that fixed and patched because the nail's sitting right here. But everything else is back together. It's fucking running. So, that's the big thing. She's back running. Got the radiator in her fans on, kicked on. She's ready. So, that was my biggest thing. But, uh, yeah. Back running. If I can focus this mug, because it's acting crazy, because it's been outside in the light and shit. But, yeah. And I forgot, I got to change that serpentine belt as well, too. Why is my camera doing it? But, uh, yeah. Stay tuned for the rest of the vlog. I don't know, it might be or it might not. This car gave me two headaches already since I got it, but no biggie. Well, it was a biggie though. First time and the second time, fuck that. I still gotta replace the windshield. That's coming soon too, so. Yeah, stay tuned and stay, keep up with the vlog, man. I appreciate y'all for watching my vlogs, tuning in and shit, but I'm about to get in the house and clean up, get in the shower, and uh, yeah, figure out how to get this tire fixed and go from there. So stay tuned for that, I'm sweating. What?
a lot the vlog is not over I am going to fool with this to see if it actually is the right one that I ordered this time so we about to see I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna try to set y'all up so y'all can see it and then we'll be right back let's see let's get it going let's see if I got this shit on right one two oh, the other way Man, it's been a long fucking day, y'all. I'm hoping this shit is right between this fucking radiator and shit like that. Because, boy, I tell you what. Oh, this shit is fucking ass. Hands dirty, all kind of shit. I am not, yeah. This ain't me. So, I'm guessing. So, this one actually does fit. It fits, y'all. <laughs> It fits. So I'm debating on if I should use the old screws or should I use the new ones? It's a hit or miss. I don't fucking know. Yeah, that is the right way. So yeah, we got to see. Stay tuned for this. We got to see. I don't know. And we're back. <laughs> ah! Oh shit. Dumbass DJ. Stupid ass DJ, that's what John called me. Dumb ass DJ, idiot. Definitely probably gonna have to paint these screws though. I want it so it can be white. But I ain't gonna do it right now because I ain't got no white paint for sure at all. Or no clear coat, so yeah. We'll do that in a minute. What the fuck? I mean, not in a minute, but sometime. I'll probably try to do something this weekend. I ain't even a lot of y'all. So this shit won't stick out like a sore thumb. Get this shit out. How will I like that though? I feel like I don't know because, in a way, this is still up. So I feel like I don't know. We're gonna figure it out, but for right now, I'm gonna show y'all what it looks like so it covers it. But what I don't like about it is it still kind of got like that hole right there. So I'm gonna try to figure out how to keep press this shit down. I have no clue how. But yeah, this side, eh, got a little gap between it, but y'all really can't see it from here. From this side, oh shit, I'm dropping shit. So, that's the start. But I'm about to figure it out off camera, and I'm going to turn this shit back on when I figure it out. And so I end up putting the rubber seal back on here to cover that hole for now, until I figure out what I'm going to do with filling it and putting this over it. So, I mean, right now, I mean, it's not bulged up all the way like it was, but yeah, a little bit now. So, I'm going to figure something out about it, but as of right now, it's better than this shit sticking out in bulge and having it on there. So yeah, we got that taken care of and we're gonna go from there when I figure out this weekend. So it is two days, well no, next day, two days, whatever. The car was still acting kind of weird after I changed everything, put everything in, it was still overheating when I drove it the other day. It went all the way up to its highest peak of the overheating. So I don't know what it was from, if it was from me not having enough radiator fluid in there or not. Also the fan didn't cut on as well though after we put the new wheel, wheel fan on there. And uh, I don't, hey. Alec, what are you doing? Uh, come here. Come here. Uh, and the fan didn't cut on, but that would end up being a fuse. The fan is on right now, so both of them are working perfectly fine. I'm still trying to figure out what, I mean, what caused it overheat. Maybe it was because I didn't put enough radiator fluid in there. So that could be a possible problem, but the fan is on right now. I'm going to show y'all here in a minute when I get out here. I'm just watching the temperature right now to make sure shit don't overheat again. I'm sitting in park. Just letting the shit run, but I also got the damn cap off for the radio thing, and I gotta show y'all that something is bubbling. I don't know, maybe the tank reservoir need to be changed as well. So this right here is bubbling. I'm not for sure why it's bubbling. I have no clue what the hell is causing that or why it's doing it. Alec, hey, I am about to kick your tail. Why are you turn the car off? You are something else. He didn't turn the car off, but yeah, and that spot is bubbling. I have no clue why. I don't know what that is. If anybody know in the comment section, let me know. But yeah, radiator fluid is fine. And then he turns the music on too as well. But the fans did kick on. This one was the one that went kick on, the one we replaced right here. But after I replaced this fuse, oh shoot, this fuse right here, it, it started working again. And he still got this music on. Allocate, turn that music off. He is something else. So that ended up kicking back on. Uh, got the Allen wrenches. I thought I had air uh, <laughs> in the... In the water pump, I had to release this with the Allen wrench. I had to go pick those up uh, today and got that up, but nothing came out, so we were good on that. But I'm still trying to figure out why this shit is bubbling. I don't know what that means or if it's going to make it run hot. If not, I'm going to change this whole tank 
out and get a new one so yeah i'm about to put the cap back on it and then just see from there if i can keep the car on why are you turning what, what are you that water hot no don't put yeah look it's hot put it put it down hold on y'all there goes the fans they both kicking on going hard both of them. so yeah i don't know we gonna see if it overheats or not the cooling is at a it's a height so we gonna see. I don't know. I don't even know if y'all can hear me because them fans is fucking loud as shit. But uh, yeah, we gonna see. I'm trying this boy. I don't know what he's back there doing. But we gonna see. What are you talking about? Oh, okay. You sing your song. Alright, uh, yeah. So we gonna see. And you turn my brights on. Why you got my brights on? What did you do? Oh, uh, you didn't turn my whole lights on. But uh, yeah, we gonna see if it overheats. I'm hoping not. I'm praying not. If not, I'm gonna change the the tank and I'm gonna change the damn thermostat and hopefully that's what it is. What you think? Uh, uh stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. All right, we take it down. Let's tell them. Stay tuned. Say we out. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna drive around the complex and see what it do. Like I said, I'm not gonna go too far because I don't trust it just yet to see exactly what this damn car gonna do. <laughs> I really want to drive it to quit here because I need to put gas in this damn car and put some air in this tire until I go get it. Uh, until I go get a patch tomorrow. Figure out with that shit the next step, but. Yeah, as of right now, I mean, it ain't doing what it did yesterday, but we ain't been driving that long. It's on your shirt, dude. So we just gonna see. And I'll turn it back on, let y'all know, see. I said, I'm just about to drive around the complex and see what the fuck is going on, see if it'll jump or not. But I'll turn this shit back on here in a minute. As of now, y'all, I'm still driving. It's still not overheating, which that's a good thing. That's a good ass thing. Uh, I've just been driving around just to see how it reacted. Sat, it sat for a minute uh, while I was putting air in this damn tire. So, I mean, it still looks fine. It got a big ass glare on this shit. Y'all can't really see, but yeah, it looks fine, though, from what I know. Now it's got the AC running and everything. So, I think we might be good. So, stay tuned for tomorrow. Like I said, as of right now, it looks perfectly fine. But, uh, I don't know. We'll wait and see tomorrow. This vlog might be over, might not. I don't know. Because, like I said, if something happened to it, I'll start it again. But I got shit going on this weekend with my brother Dante. So, stay tuned for that. If it's in a different video. I don't know if it's going to be in this video or the next video. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. This might be the end of it. It might not. So, I'll turn this shit back on if something crazy happened. If not, then we good to go. And then y'all see the shit that me and my brother got going on for tomorrow. So, all right. We out.